I've been having these weird thoughts lately. Like, is any of this for real? Or not? That was a fat beat. God, I love that song. Hikaru Utada? Utada Hikaru? I don't know how to say her name. I've seen it written forwards, backwards is a Japanese thing. I don't know which one's her first name. Love that song, though. Welcome, guys, to our brand new play from the Mark 9 channel. This is Kingdom Hearts. One of the greatest video game franchises of all time, in my personal opinion. And certainly one of my favorite games ever. Yeah, I know how to control. I'm not good at it, but I know. Is this, this feels backwards. It's inverted, I think. Eh, it's weird. It's like backwards, but it feels kind of normal. Anyway, so this is the Kingdom Hearts final mix. I have, I bought a collection uh, on PS4, the story so far, which is basically Kingdom Hearts in its final iteration, like Kingdom Hearts 1.5, then 2.5, the, the games and cutscenes in between uh, Kingdom Hearts 2.8 as well as Kingdom Hearts 3. So I have all those. I've got them sitting right here. And I want to jump into this franchise. This is this is among a handful of games that inspired me to do YouTube. So it's crazy that I'm doing this in like my fourth year. There's just a lot of games that I wanted to play. A lot of other games that, that uh, came out that I wanted to give a try. And uh, now I finally got the opportunity to play Kingdom Hearts. The music, the soundtrack on here is absolutely phenomenal. I have listened to it, whether I'm reading a book, doing laundry, or driving on the freeway. I love the music of this game and the gameplay and everything. It just had such a profound impact on me and a major influence when it first came out. It's a, when did this come out? It was like 2002 or something like that. It was around there, wasn't it? All right, I need to figure out, let me take a look real fast the controls. Is it let me do it yet? No, I don't think it's going to let me change the controls. I need to get used to the invert. <sighs> yeah, the inversion. I'll have to play around with that. All right, so we've got defense, magic, and then combat. I'm going to pick this one. Oh, it wants me to jump, right? 
I love the animations, the jumping. Also, too, if you get the PS4 version and you play it on a PlayStation 5 like I am now, humble brag, it boosts the uh, FPS to 60, which is pretty sweet. Oh, I have to jump on it. That's right. I thought I had to pick it up. Uh, jump on it. The power of the warrior. Invincible courage. A sword of terrible destruction. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't remember exactly what these do. Maybe a stronger stat boost and everything. I'm not sure. I'm going to give up magic. It's fine. I'm a hack and slash type person, so... Doesn't mean I can't use magic. It's just the weakest stat. Yeah, it's fine. I gotta change the controls, though, if it lets me. I don't want to get used to... I don't want to get used to an inverted camera. As much as I love these games, I have read, like, the fandoms, the wikis, and every little bit of data that I possibly could to try and understand the story, and I don't know anything. The games... <laughs> the storylines are so confusing. I love the games, but God, I don't know... <laughs> not, none of it makes any sense to me. They could just be me, that, but I feel like it's... It's incredibly complicated for no reason. Yeah, I would... I don't like that... The controls are a little annoying. I want, like, square to attack, X to jump, circle to dodge. The green gauge displays your hit points. Yep. Blue gauge shows your magic points. Magic is still a mystery. That's fine. The darkness. Darkness! Yeah, that's right. I killed your brother. You gain experience. It'll, it'll take a while to get used to the controls. Most games don't use this type of mapping. Defeated enemies sometimes leave items behind. Yes. HP or magic power. Generally, you'll automatically target the nearest enemy, but you can lock on. Yeah. Locking on our target limits the actions available to you, especially against other targets. It's crazy playing this game in 60 FPS. I think it's automatic. I don't think you gotta... I don't think you gotta pay for that upgrade. It feels like 60. I don't know. Maybe it's 30. Maybe I'm full of BS, I don't know, but... Looks good to me. It's the best this game ever looked. Yeah, Circle is a... Field that kind of pops up. Whenever uh, a special command is available, okay? It's been long, so long since I've played these. These games. basics of controls down before the story moves us forward. Man, it must be a pain shopping for shoes for this kid. 
big ass feet. Hey, hold on, the door won't open just yet. Uh. feels like the door opened. Yeah, it's weird. Titus from Final Fantasy X. I think, wasn't he also Final Fantasy X? What do you want out of life? Broaden my horizons. What are you afraid of? Getting old, being indecisive. I suppose that would make sense. What's most important to you? Hmm. Prize possessions. Friendship is the best choice. Yeah. You want to broaden your horizons. You're afraid of being indecisive. You want friendship. I feel like these were the best answers. Given that we had available. It's rather limiting. Those wouldn't be the actual decisions I would choose. Your adventure begins at midday. Keep a steady pace and you'll come through fine. Cool, sounds good. The day you will open the door is both far off and very near. I see. This island is so small, too. They act like, or they talk about, I think, how they never left the island. Or maybe it's just a part of it that we interact with that's small. I always thought the island was kind of tiny. Press the options button to open the menu screen. In the main menu, you can do things like view your inventory and status or configure game settings. Yes. Oh, you can't open a battle. Okay, well. <laughs> okay. I want if I can reconfigure the configure the buttons, I will. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, I got it. Oh, that's right. The air attacks are so smooth. It's so clean on PS4. Oh my gosh. Are these experience balls or those health? I think maybe the orange ones are experience balls or orbs. No, I don't know. I don't remember. I don't know. Everything about this game is incredibly satisfying. Square really did a great job with this. I think at the time when this game was first released, it was Squaresoft and they rebranded to Square Enix, I think. Save point. Yeah. It's a good idea to save often. If anything goes wrong, you can then load your save data and resume from there. Maybe it's not inverted. No, it's not. Okay. I'm getting used to the controls. I might need to make it a little bit quicker, though. Actually, can I do it now? No. Well, oh, it does let me. Okay, let's take a look. Config, auto lock, camera vibration, camera access, normal, normal. Got it. Difficulty, final mix, whatever that means. Camera, manual, target lock. Is there... Oh, we're, is awakening the name of the mission that we're in? So I can't change the speed of it. Target lock. Automatically lock on the nearest target. Press the X button to view controller settings. I want everything to be manual. Huh. Customize. Okay, yeah, that's how we do our, like, powers and stuff, right? Spells. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I can change around with that. It's a little frustrating that it doesn't give you the option, but that's, that's how life is. Because I want to be able to move it faster. It's a little slow. The camera's heavy, but it's fine. It'll be right. 
closer you get to light, the greater your shadow becomes. But don't be afraid. <laughs> and don't forget. point is the hands. That kind of hurt. I guess lock-on really helps when the camera's working against you. Such a crazy concept. Final Fantasy characters mixed with Disney, like what a wild choice. But it really works. Strongest weapon of all, your spirit, your soul, bravery, I don't know. It's been a long time. You are the one who will open the door. Cool, cool. Now what? Oh, we have to do a bunch of the mini games around the island, huh? Whoa! <laughs> Give me a break, Kyrie. So are you lazy bum. I knew that I'd find you snoozing down here. No, this huge black thing swallowed me up. I couldn't breathe, I couldn't... Ow. Are you still dreaming? It wasn't a dream. Or was it? I don't know. What was that place? So bizarre. Yes, yeah, sure. Say, Kyrie, what was your hometown like? You know, where you grew up? I've told you before, I don't remember. Nothing at all? Nothing. Do you ever want to go back? To nothing? Mm, well, I'm happy here. Really? But you yep. know, I wouldn't mind going to see it. I'd like to see it too. Along with any other worlds out there. I want to see them all. So what are we waiting for? Hey! Aren't you guys forgetting about me? So... I guess I'm the only one working on the raft. Ah. <laughs> and you're just as lazy as he is. <laughs> so you know this. Okay, we'll finish it together. I'll race you. Huh? What? Are you kidding? <laughs> Ready? Go!
Hearts Final Mix. It's funny, I think they called it that because there's been so many variations of the game over the years. Reissued for like every console gen, I think. Destiny at Highlands. Delightful excitement and adventure awaits. I don't know why I was doing that voice. All right, we got mini games to do now. Uh, let's see what we got. So can you gather the rest of the supplies? Uh, yeah, I heard you. Two logs, one cloth, one rope. Okay, I sort of remember where this stuff is. He's got such a goofy jump. I do like it, though. He doesn't ledge grab, does he? Let's find out. Oh, he does. Fantastic. No fall damage. Such a masterpiece for the time. All right, there's the rope. Where's the other log now? Must be over there. Ha! Wasn't Haley Joel Osment the voice of Sora as well? weird when you think about it now. He went from pay it forward to the mesmerizer. Ain't that a thing. There you are. What up? Yeah, I think that's like, this island is so freaking tiny. Found some today too. It's yours. High potion. All right, tired. Want to call it a day? Yeah, that's fine. So, Kyrie's home is out there somewhere, right? Could be. We'll never know by staying here. But how far did a rat take us? Who knows? If we have to. We'll think of something else. So, suppose you get to another world. <laughs> what would you do there? Hmm. Well, I... I haven't really thought about it. It's just... I've always wondered why we're here, on this island. If there are any other worlds out there. Why did we end up on this one? And, suppose there are other worlds then ours is just a little piece of something much greater. So, we could have just as easily ended up somewhere else, right? I don't know. Exactly. That's why we need to go out there and find out. Just sitting here won't change a thing. It's the same old stuff. So let's go. You've been thinking a lot lately, haven't you? Thanks to you, if you hadn't come here, I probably would have never thought of any of this. Kari, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Sora! You wanted one, didn't you? A palpu fruit? If two people share one, their destinies become intertwined. They'll remain a part of each other's lives, no matter what. Come on, I know you want to try it. What are you talking?
<laughs> Absurd. Love them. What an unnecessarily large room. <laughs> it's nice to see you, this one. What? Same energy, same vibe. That was cool. <laughs> Zapped. Hey there, Donald. Good morning. We got a problem, Goofy. But don't tell anyone. Ooh. Queen Minnie? Not even the queen. Daisy? No! It's top secret. Oh, good morning, ladies. What? Actually, wait, do we have, like, quests and stuff for all these people? Hey, Sora. Have you heard about the legendary power of the Palpu fruit? They say if you share it with someone you really care for, it binds you together forever and ever, through eternity. <sighs> it's so romantic. I gotta try it sometime. Yeah, her eyes are nuts. Absolutely crazy eyes. Oh, I think he has a ball game that we gotta play. Me and Titus, we are gonna do a little exploring today. You know, to the secret place at the base of that tree. There's gotta be something there, yeah? Okay. Then we have a race and a bunch of other little things we have to do. What's up, Tootie? stronger but odds are you're still no match for Riku we took him on three to one last time and he whipped us all well I guess Kyrie can always count on him Jeez, come on ha! all right so are we supposed to go in that little grotto area now or what That would give you mad chafing, seriously. I like how he does that little flip. All right, well, I guess we're gonna go check it out. Oh, then maybe that's where they are? I don't know, we'll see. Let's find out. Let's find out. The secret place. Where are you, Riku and Kairi? It's been far too long since I played these games and I do not remember. See, oh, good, save point. 
all the animations, all the sounds, the little clicks, the little chimes, the little bumps. It's all so pleasant to the ear. God, the sound team? So impressive, seriously. Okay, there's that up there. To the cove we go. There she is. Talk to you in a second. Wait, what? No, whatever. Worry about it later. Okay. What do we got, Kyrie? What's going on? Grass almost ready. All we have to do now is load it with food. Have you seen Riku? Where is my man at? I'm still really bad with the controls, so these this race that we're going to do in a bit is going to be really tough. Out. There we go. It's okay. There he is. Oh, come on. Hey, Sora, our rap still needs a name. Let's see. How about High Wind? What would you call it? I win is pretty good. Where is Circle to Believe? You guys at it again? Alright, I'll be judged. Alright, we're gonna race. I'm gonna lose it the first time. I feel like I always do. Taking out any route you want. The star is the end, huh? Okay. It's not the first time I get tree. Make it back here. If wins. I win, uh, I'm captain. And if you win, I get to share the palpu with Kyrie. Huh? Deal? The winner gets to share a palpu with Kyrie. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, on my count. Oh, wrong button. I keep on wanting to hit X for jump. I actually don't know if this is faster. We're going to find out. Oh, dude, what? Are you serious right now? Why did you jump off? I didn't even hit a button. Did I have to hold it? Oh, no. Lost. Yeah, I'm screwed. Shoot. Yeah, I knew that sucked. Because, like, it's not it's not intuitive. Exit doesn't feel like how you strike. Damn it. That sucks. Or I just feel like X is the jump button always. Yeah, this is tough. Getting used to the controls on this is really weird. Which is strange, because it's not... The controls aren't bad, it's just... Ugh. See, I, I don't know. Sometimes he jumps and sometimes he doesn't. The, the button prompts aren't quite on top of it. And, like... He can't get on top of the tree from here, and he can't climb up... ...that either. Whatever, I might as well take my time and get used to this. Oh, what? I tried so hard before to jump up that and didn't work. That's embarrassing. Oof. Yikes, dude. Sucks to suck. Can we go again? 
Just a joke. You should have seen your face. How about another lap around the course? Okay, I want to try again to see if I can actually win it this time. I know what to expect a little bit more. Oh, nice. Dunked on him there. Dude, climb up the damn thing so he doesn't latch on to it. This is the part that I have to... Oh, son of a bitch. I think it's because I was holding on to the button. Oh, come on, dude. Damn it. Lost again. Yeah, one false move and it's over. Because like I'm jumping on at the ladder, but I thought he would grab onto it at the highest point, and both times he did not do that. Yeah, screwed up big time. He's also, he's not jumping every time I hit the jump button. I don't know what the deal is. I want to win this. I want to prove that I can win it. Jeez. I had him when I hit that that platform. All right, let's do one more. If, if I lose, I lose. I'll And I'll move on. Okay. I just want to want to get there. I want to prove that I can do it. Nice. See, at this point, I might as well just take the route. The route that he's taking. Why make it harder on myself, you know? God, son of a... Come on! That, that ledge is rounded, so he can't grab onto it either. You have to be right on the edge there. All right. He beat me three times. I suck. Yeah, I seen it. It's right... Somehow, right at the edge of that, it... I don't think he's getting a good stance on the edge when I'm trying to... When I'm trying to jump. Because, like, he's... Yeah, I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird behavior. Does he swim? Let me see if he can swim. I'm curious. Yeah, he does. I think there's levels where you can swim later on. Damn it. Sucks. All right, all right. <sighs> okay, whatever. Let's move on. Okay, I didn't make it that time. Let's see. Sorry, looking for one seagull egg, three mushrooms, two coconuts, three fish. Okay. Gotcha. Alright, so I've seen some of the fish. I don't know if there are any on this side. Let's go grab or take a quick little look. We got one mushroom there. I know I saw a seagull egg on top of the trees. Maybe not on this side. I think it was the other side. But The fish are easy to spot, so if they're here, they're not. Okay. So I don't think... How do I get to you? Oh, well, he did that time. He... Yeah, I guess it's got to be so precise. So let me figure this out. Why are you doing that? Why is he jumping? So when I hold the button to jump, which I was doing, he leaps off of it. Yeah, I don't know what that is. It just didn't work it, both times. There we go. Protect chain. I should be able to equip that. It's wrong button. I keep hitting that too. Um, Did that? Okay, so that thing only works one way, one time, unless the instance loads, so that rope doesn't do me any good. Okay. Alright, so I think we got everything that we could do from here. Mushrooms and stuff. Yeah, let's just go back. God, I hate that. I can't believe I lost so bad three times. 
I know I've won in the past, but that was just shameful. Okay. There is... There's two fish over there. Now, do I just run over them, or do I have to do some sort of action to grab them? There's one. There's the other. Okay. Oh, he does have a speed boost. Circle does a little bit of a push. All right, there's the seagull egg there. How do we get, I see. Gotcha. It's not really a lot of food, by the way. And you're on the wrap, so there's like no real way to cook it either. Okay, fish. You can see them pretty far off in the distance. There it is. Another mushroom. And clean drinking water, which I think is here. Alright, mushy mushy mushroom, where are you? See, he's not really good at grabbing onto that ladder. Nothing in here. I don't think it's in here, but I also wasn't really paying attention last time I was in here. Yeah, there it is. Or not. The drawings in here. Oh, it is here. Oh, okay, got it. All right. <laughs> I hate racing. I suck at that stuff. to see the door to this world. Huh? This world has been connected. Well, what are you talking about? Is that Mr. Krabs? Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Well, maybe not. Well, whoever you are, stop freaking me out like this. Huh? Well, well where did you come from? do not yet know what lies beyond the door. So you're from another world. There is so very much to learn. I thought it was Clancy Brown, but You no. understand so little. Well, he's a kid, what do you expect? Oh yeah? Well you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand. Nothing. That makes no sense. One who knows nothing has everything to learn and, and gain, you know? Stupid statement. It's just nothing words. A meaningless effort? What do you mean? Meaningless effort. That's like, it's, it's, that, that was just such an idiotic, dark and ominous thing just for the sake of being dark and ominous. Nothing about what he said holds true, and it takes like half a brain so to realize how much BS that is. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. What? What? So a newborn baby who like grows and starts to learn can't understand anything because it's born not understand. Like what? Come on now. Come on now. Uh, idiot words. 
Actually, X, I just feel like square should be attack. X should jump. Circle should be to dive roll. Triangle can be whatever else. I'm not racing you again. You beat me three times. I get it. My pride, my ego. It all hurts. I do want to figure out this thing. Why doesn't this work? Like, what is... Oh, that time it did. I just tapped it, and then he was on it. I guess he can't hold it for very long. I don't know. That was weird. This, I'm making a necklace of Thalassa shells. In the old days, sailors always wore Thalassa shells. They were supposed to ensure a safe voyage. See this? It's a charm to help us find each other if we ever get separated. Oh, I think that goes on his keyblade, doesn't it? The three of us will always be together. Uh, okay. Wow, you didn't slack off this time. Just kidding. Let's see. What's still missing? One mushroom, two coconuts, some... Can oh, there was a third mushroom? Okay, my bad. I don't know why I thought about... Didn't. I thought it was only two. Okay, that's fine. And then... I completely forgot about the coconuts. Alright, I think the coconuts are over there. One more mushroom, though. I honestly don't know where that's at. I think... Weren't there supposed to be, like... Don't you knock them out of the tree? There it is. So I don't get it. Is this not... Why, am I, why can't I pick him up? Does that not count? Weird. Okay. Well, I guess we'll keep looking since those don't work. Another mushroom. Damn. I don't remember where this one is. Mushroom, 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 mushroom. So both mushrooms were in a kind of a wet, damp spot. I would think maybe one out here. See, right here would make sense. Ah, they're green. Those are special ones. Got a. Hey, there we go. Okay. Alright, what are the odds that the other mushrooms in the cove? It might be under a box or a crate or whatever. Could check that. Where are you, old friend? Lucky I looked in that direction, or other, I never would have found that. Huh. Alright, girl, I'm right here. I got you. Thanks, Sora. I found something today, too. Here, it's yours. High potion. Tired. Wanna call it a day? Yeah. Okay. Tomorrow's the big day. We should rest up. You know, Riku has changed. What do you mean? Well. Puberty. Okay. He's getting armpit hair. Sora, let's take the raft and go. Without him? Two of us. Huh? That's a jerk <laughs> move. Just kidding. You're not. It's gotten into you. You're the one that's changed, Kyrie. Maybe. You know, I was a little afraid at first. 
But now I'm ready. No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. Bill. Right? Bell. Yeah, of course. That's good. Sora, don't ever change. Huh? I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. Donald! <laughs> Sorry to rush off without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing, huh? <laughs> Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, huh? And that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I've got to go check into it, huh? <laughs> that South Park episode kills me. There's something with a key, the key to our survival. So I need you and Goofy to find it. Stick with them, got it, huh? We need that key and we're all doomed. So go to Traverse Town and find Leon. They'll point you in the right direction, huh? Love Leon. P.S. Would you apologize to made for me? Thanks, pal. Uh huh? Oh dear! What could this mean? I just told you. It means. <laughs> Look at the Mickey you posters in the wall. Just have to trust the king. Gorge. I sure hope he's all right. <laughs> Gorge. <laughs> now both of you <laughs> oh and to chronicle your travels he will accompany you is it jiminy cricket Over yeah here quick is the name jiminy cricket at your service we hope for your safe return please help the king oh Gorge. <laughs> Goofballs. Gorge, Jiminy. Your world disappeared, too. It was terrible. We were scattered. And as far as I can see, I'm the only one who made it to this castle. Goofy. Oh, right. I got you. You mean while we're in other worlds, we can't let on where we're from, huh? We gotta protect the world border. The multiverse. Right. World border. <laughs> oh. They did it first. The multiverse. Oh, I guess we'll need new duds when we get there, huh? Kill. <laughs> A gorge. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Oh, the gummy ship. I hate this thing, dude. I was never good at this. Oh, it's the chipmunks. Chippendale? They're the freaking best, dude. Disney has some of the best characters. <laughs> A gorge. world to live on it's weird how they're like multiverse is planet based it's not like it's not very great it's just like a single town on each world it's just for art direction i'm sure it's not actually like that but it's interesting how it's displayed that way i just can't wait once we set sail it'll be great 
Age thing is weird these characters. Oh no! The raft! Kairi seems like she's 10, Sora seems like he's 12, and Riku seems like he's 13, or maybe Sora's Sora, 11. Sora! Dinner's ready! Come on down! Sora? Isn't the only reference to his parents is his mom's voice? What's that? Yeah, no kidding, dude. Riku's boat! And Kairi's! Time for a fight, son. Oh, snap. Dang it. Alright. Oh, what the heck? I can't hit him. Why are you not jumping up there? It's dark. You can barely tell where I'm at right now. What is the deal? Alright. Whatever. There he is over there. Riku, I'm being attacked by shadow monsters over here. Oh, the wooden sword doesn't hurt him. I forgot. That's right. Where's Kairi? I thought she was with you. The door is open. What, what are you talking about, fool? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kairi. Kairi's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Riku. See, he was evil from the beginning. Ah, there we go. Now I can fight back, you little turds. Eventually, but I do love fighting these guys. Alright, so I don't know. I thought the oranges around him were supposed to be indicators of experience, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh. Because the one, one P. The lock on system in this game is very smooth, though. I also don't know if there's like a finite amount of enemies here or if it's endless waves. Because they are numerary. I think we gotta go fight Kyrie. Maybe that was it. I want the dive roll. I know, I remember that was an ability. Oh my gosh. Alright, no 
we're fighting these extras. Let's grab these little orbs. And move on. To the door. Okay. Think of such little experience, it's not really worth the fight. I can't move my camera. Come on. Alright, whatever. Kyrie! Sora. you fool. Spank you right in the butt. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Right in the hole. Nice. Keep spanking. Fantastic. The combat's always been super smooth in this game. The Heartless, it, like, are repetitive, yes, but the combat still, it just feels sharp. It's very well done for the time and for present. It still plays very well. Just gotta get used to the controls. X to jump just makes the most sense, you know what I mean? Ooh. 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 The Traverse Town theme song is one of the best songs in this whole game. I used to play this. I used to play Traverse Town on repeat. Love that song. Traverse Town. No, maybe we ought to go find Leon. Oh, Donald, uh, you know, I uh, bet you that, uh... Ah, what do you know, you big coyote? Ooh, what do <laughs> I know? Hmm. Come on, Pluto! This town is very small, but it can get kind of confusing. I think this is also where the 101 Dalmatians are at. Well, they're scattered across the whole game, but I think you're introduced to them here. Oh, snap. Sora's been drinking. Oh, you lick your butt with that. Oh. Oh. Uh. Huh? What a dream. Ah! <laughs> Smash. This isn't a dream. Dog's like, wake up, idiot. Oh, where am I? Oh, boy. Indeed. Do you know where we are? It's a dog. Oh, hey! But he he kind of gets it. All right. 
I think that's a good point for us to stop on our first episode. Thank you for watching. I'm very excited to continue on this playthrough. I'm hoping you guys are looking forward to it as well, because I feel like this is one of those games that's not only really fun to play, but it's also really fun to watch. So I'm looking forward to all that and more when we continue on with our playthrough of Kingdom Hearts 1 in the next episode, which will debut, well, I guess the next day, depending on when you watch this for you, it could be already out now. But anyway, new episodes of this playthrough will be up uh, daily at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So if you're watching this in the future, they're all out. If you're not, then, you know, that's when you can look forward to them. But nonetheless, if you enjoyed this episode of Kingdom Hearts, though, you can show your love by hitting the like button. Do not forget to subscribe. Any feedback for me, leave in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Also, don't forget to take a look at the description box. There are some links that might be of interest to you, one of which is a link to the Mark and Nine community Discord server. If you want to be part of that group, you can chat with me directly. Otherwise, just know that I appreciate you and your time and hope to see you when we continue with more of our playthrough of Kingdom Hearts. All right, guys. That's it for me. Take care. Be well. I'll see you next time. Later.